As you know, coalition forces killed Zarqawi and one of his top lieutenants, Sheikh Al Rahman, yesterday on June 7th at 6.15 p.m. in an airstrike against an identified, isolated safe house. The success was a product of painstaking intelligence gathering from local sources and from within, made possible both by the Iraqis who have made the determination to uphold the legitimate authority in their own nation and the slow, deliberate exploitation of leaves person to person through evidence since December of 2003. The elimination of Zarqawi has dealt a serious blow to al-Qaeda in Iraq. I think arguably over the last several years, no single person on this planet has had the blood of more innocent men, women, and children on his hands than Zarqawi. He personified the dark, sadistic, and medieval vision of the future of beheadings, and suicide bombings, and indiscriminate killings. A, a behavior pattern that has been rejected by the overwhelming majority of the Iraqi people, whether Sunni, Shias, or Kurds, and certainly by the overwhelming majority of Muslims worldwide.